Okay, another quick tutorial for Paddy, this one on the script editor. <coughs> uh, this is going to be on the editor, not on recording. Um, we'll have to do a separate video on recording a script. Um, the editor is just very powerful and can do some things that, that you can't record, quite frankly. Let's see under script, editing a script, um, and as everything in Paddy has the function select box on the right. And uh, here our script on the left in this case, it's a new file. Um, line number, what to do, which module to do it in, and what parameter. Uh, right now it's a pause of one second, as you can see. We'll just insert a new line above, and we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna just have some fun with this fun little picture there. Uh, so, uh, for instance, I'm gonna go and do a filter preset, snowman. Um, this, this picture here has a little snowman, so I, I, I wrote a little filter that just does this. Um, and just for uh, just because you can, I right click on this and I say I want you to execute that in the develop module. This will force Patty to go uh, wherever wherever it is. It will force Patty to go to the development window. Um, the next step, I'm just going to overwrite this pause here. I'm just by clicking on it. Uh, I want to go in there and I want to apply um, say auto tone. Uh, insert a line. Uh, I want to apply auto white balance, insert a line, oops, this was above, uh, just hit delete and it's going to vanish, um, insert below, uh, I want to um, go into crop, which is under development tools, crop, uh, you know what, I'm just going to set the crop to 1 to 1, um, and then I want to insert a line below, and I want essentially to end up with my adjustment brush. There you go. Uh, actually, let's just make sure that the panel opens automatically as well. Um, I can switch these uh, modules here all to development. Um, this should work by hitting Control D. Yep, Control D, switch to development. Um, you can see here the parameter for our filter preset. Uh, if there is unknown, it means that Patty doesn't switch. Okay, let's save this. File, save. I'm going to save this under video example. It already exists, so I'm just going to overwrite the existing one. I'm going to say done. Um, a bunch of other things you can do here. You can insert a pause, etc. But let's just sort of keep this. So now let's see whether it works. I'm very curious here myself, to be honest. Um, I'm going to um, play back the script. Video example switches over to development module. It applies cropping. Uh, there you go. So it doesn't look like it actually applied the crop ratio. Um, let's see, I'm just going to go back to import. Um, library, you can see it applied our little uh, filter module here. Let's just uh, reset this all, uh, have a look at our script. Um, I think what we need to do is we need to actually open file open. We need to open the uh, crop tool before we apply the crop ratio, which I guess makes sense. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go here, we're going to insert a line. Before that, I just hit the insert button to do this crop. I'm going to go into the crop tool. I'm also going to hit Ctrl D to move this to development. Set crop to set crop to one on one, and then I'm going to do crop uh, and done close crop. Oops. Uh, Edit, insert line below, and I want to end up with my spot removal tool. <coughs> spot removal tool, alright. Done. Oh, didn't save it. Uh, return to the editor. File, save. Done. Okay, let's try this again. Playback script. Example. Alright, switch over to develop. Auto tone, auto bounce, crop, exit. And we have our little, as you can see, adjustment brush. So there you go. That works. Um, as you can see, um, sometimes you have to play around with this. It's very, very powerful. Essentially, anything you can do in a normal mode, you can put in a script like this. Um, and I will record also a video on how to uh, record a script. Uh, the challenge with that one is that not everything can be uh, recorded. For instance, if you type in a filter, it will not record that. Uh, that's why I personally like for some of these actions, uh, like the script editor better. Have a good one, see you next time.